So was there a different approach this time? Or was it the, yeah, we made shots. Yeah. That was the whole thing. The approach didn't change much. We just made shots. You know, that's what I kind of figured it was. It was going to come back to We were able to control the tempo. And, you know, so it's basically what we were able to do, both offensively and defensively. Especially Johnny made shots for you. I mean, yeah. You well, you know, that's the kind of team we've been. You've got to look at our scoring throughout the playoffs. In our first round game, Aaron West Kodiak leads us with 31. Second game, Selena and Petra was 26. Third game, Burton Force was 23. And today, Johnny had, I don't know what you wound up with, but 26. 26. Okay. You know, and it's kind of been that way. Did, did you see that from her? I mean, did you know? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Johnny's a great shooter. You know, we, we knew that was possible. You know, so, hey, Lauren. Coming in, though, was that part of the game plan? Was yeah. That, yeah, yeah. oh, definitely. We knew we, they were so big inside, we knew we had to hit threes. So we wanted to spread the floor, dribble, penetrate. And eventually we figured that they would come to double the ball and we'd wind up with open threes either from Johnny or Selena, and we did. Was there a moment when you knew Johnny was on today? That, that yeah, as soon as she made the first one. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. Why is that? I mean, what was well, it? we just, you know, she'd been struggling a little bit and worked on some things that, you know, a little flaw in her shot. And we kind of had her straightened out, I felt. Okay. Yeah, I felt like, hey, she let him go. We felt good about it. We stopped Johnny so I could watch him for a while. Never mind. Uh, Defensively, I mean, they scored in the 60s, I think, against you guys both times, and they caught them to 47. I mean, what was different on that side? We didn't give them transition baskets. We didn't turn the ball over. I think they scored six or eight points the last time we played them, stealing the ball off rebounders. I think they got one like that today, and that was early in the game. So I, I think that was a big, big key. Yeah. You've seen them so many times, and you kind of know everything they do. Does it help you guys going into a game like this? I mean, where there's really nothing they're going to come out with that's going to surprise you Right. You know, we, I'd, I'd have to say we were pretty prepared for everything they did. You know, when you're as good as they are, there's no reason for you to change what you're doing. You know, without, you know we just were better prepared for it. What a... What was the atmosphere like before the game? You guys had lost about eight times in a row. Them, we don't even think about that. I mean, that's you know, that's, that's all nice. You know, we, we felt pretty good coming in. And actually, even that first game, we, we got crushed. We still come down to we missed open shots. We had seven turnovers. We just missed a ton of open shots. And you know, it was the same the second time. You know, we knew if we made shots, that, and we didn't know how they would react being behind because you know they never were really behind like that before. With the rivalry between the two teams, is it better beating them in this championship? Does it make it more? Oh yeah, yeah. You know what? It's not just the rivalry, sure, but yeah, they've been so dominant for so many years. I, I, I mean, it, that that makes it better, you know. So yeah, it's, it's great beating. Them. Um, the last year was the first time you guys got to the finals, right. the first championship. I mean, what does it mean for the program to get that title? Uh, well, I don't know. We've been pretty solid over the years. It was just, you know, trying to get over that, that hump. You know, I've had really good kids playing for me. I really enjoy it. And, you know, they're, they're all pretty much local kids from around the school. And, you know, so it's, it, it's been fun doing it. What were your thoughts and what did you say to the team when they get it down to five <coughs> that are late in the game and are making a big push? Oh, just we take care of the ball and defend. I mean, like we told him the whole game. I mean, there was nothing, you know, nothing. I mean, we made a couple little adjustments and getting somebody up and putting, some, you know, Selena come up to the foul line and, uh, you know, it opened, gave him a different look and opened some things. But so we don't turn the ball over, they can't score. You know, I wish we would have made some more foul shots.